Now we're in the process of resurrecting this aquarium. Um, we actually took the live rock out and put it in the garden for a period of time just because of the amount of um, Valonia bubble algae was completely covering it. Now since we've put the, the rock outside for a couple of weeks the bubble algae has dried off and fallen off beautifully. We've since reset up the tank, done a couple of large water changes and we have added a bit of new rock because what the new rock will do is cure, is cycle and add organisms to the old rock so it all becomes live once again. We've added the coral back in and it's going to be important that we monitor the water for the next couple of weeks to see if there is any impact of this um, fresh rock. I don't expect there to be but we definitely want to check on it and then after the next couple of weeks we'll make sure the salini is on the low side and then we can look at adding a couple of fish back in maybe a little wrasse or a hawk fish to help control potential pests like bristle worms and then maybe another four weeks later we might look at putting a couple of a tang or a blenny in something to help control the algae and then over that time we can start populating the corals back in and providing that the water quality is kept up to scratch then there's no reason at all why they won't all thrive and it's really important that we're selecting relatively easy corals to keep we don't want anything fancy particularly if we're um, rebooting the tank